Weekly cleaning instructions for the TurboChef High H conveyor oven. Use only TurboChef approved cleaning chemicals. Failure to adhere to these procedures or the use of any other cleaning products may damage critical oven components, resulting in a non warranty service call. You will need TurboChef oven cleaner, TurboChef oven guard, nylon scrub pad, and clean towels. You will need to wash, rinse, sanitize, and dry each part after removing them. Do not use a hose or water jet on any parts for this oven. Step one, turn the oven off. Press the back or off key until the oven begins cooling down. Allow the oven to completely cool. The screen will say oven off. The ovens operate at temperatures of up to 550 degrees Fahrenheit or 285 degrees Celsius and may cause injury if not allowed to cool properly. Next, remove outer oven components. Remove the air filter and rinse with hot water. Wipe the vent with a clean, damp rag. Remove the extenders. Crumb trays. Chain guard. and the door. Then remove the inner components. Remove the drive chain. To remove the drive chain, lift the belt up to loosen the chain and remove the chain from the gear. Start by removing the left side chain first. Lift the right side of the belt and remove the right side of the chain. Remove the belt. Then remove the upper and lower jet plates. Unscrew the eyebrows. Be sure to make note of which holes you are using on the eyebrows. Next, clean all oven components thoroughly. Wash, rinse, sanitize, and dry the components and wipe out the oven cavity. Reinstall the belt. Reinstall the right side chain and chain guard first. Then reinstall the left side chain and chain guard. Replace both the top and bottom jet plate. Reinstall the eyebrows and remember which holes your eyebrows were set at. Reinstall crumb trays, extenders, and the door. Position the holes on the door above the pins on the oven and push down in place. I'll replace the filters on the back of the oven and wipe down the oven exterior. Your oven is now ready to turn on.